A 75 year old woman is alive tonight following a six hour ordeal after a stranger followed her home, threw her in the trunk of her own car and then tied her up and bound her in duct tape in his home. That suspect now identified as Tony Lamar White. Sheriff Matthew Wade said White attacked Betty Cobb with a knife after following her to three different stores on the 4th of July. Wade says it's a miracle they found Cobb alive. She was uh, in his house in a closet, duct taped and bound. This is stuff that uh, horror movies are made from. This guy is definitely somebody that's dangerous and we have to get him as soon as possible. Investigators say this is not something anyone would do out of the blue, and they suspect White has attacked women at random before. Now, this is a composite sketch made after attacks on separate women in 2012 and 2013 that remain unsolved. Uh, we will catch Mr. White. We will see if he is part of this same group, same person, because uh, we do have DNA. But if it is connected, he's a dangerous person and we need to do something to find him. He is uh, uh, extremely dangerous. We're told White ran after investigators say he got a call from his ex-wife asking what he had done after investigators came to her home searching for him. Marie Waxel, Way 31 News.